All right, what's up, guys? It's your boy Johnny here, back with another video on the channel. I've not even been to bed yet, but I wanted to show you guys all the unreleased vehicles and some of the content. Unfortunately, my GTA 5 on my PC, I was uh, gonna be able to um, like pretty much like show gameplay of the un unreleased vehicles. But I'm just gonna show you guys some pictures and like talk about them and show you guys some HD images of all the new DLC vehicles that are going to be coming out here in the next couple weeks now every week uh we should be getting a new car and when that happens i will buy the car showcase all the good stuff and also i'm gonna tell you guys the prices for everything for every so you guys everything you guys need to know i'll tell you guys and uh let me put my webcam on one second there we go okay so start with the first one this is the kara kara 2 i believe is this the one we just got in game i'm pretty sure it is uh today if i'm not mistaken and then we got the dynasty uh, I'm not sure, too sure how I feel about this one right here. Looks all right. By the way, shot the foxy snaps, man. Uh, go go ahead and give him a foul. I'll leave his link in the description and fun too as well, because <clears throat> they do really hard work, man. Him and uh, fun too do a great job with leaks and stuff in the morning. So shout out to them. But uh, the drafter, this is the one we did get in game today. I'm pretty sure. The drafter, the Audi looks really really nice. And then this one right here, the uh, I believe it's called the. Amuris. This was in the trailer, I'm pretty sure. If I'm not mistaken. This is like some kind of McLaren, I'm pretty sure. And this this one looks really dope. These are just like the in-game like files, like mod folders. That's why it's not like HD, but you guys can clearly, you know, see the uh see what they look like. Now this is the Gauntlet 3. Let me know what you guys think about that thing. It looks pretty dope for a muscle car. And then we got the Gauntlet 4. That's what I, I believe this is called the Hellcat. And I can't wait for that, dude. That looks nice. There's also an HD image. I'll pull up for that. And next we got the Helion. Um, it looks just like some kind of SC. This looks like a Range Rover, I think, if I'm not mistaken. And then right here is the SC. This is the one we got in game. Okay. Where do you get that in game today? Uh, this one right here is the Jaguar. Almost sounds like Jaguar. That looks really dope. I can't wait to get that. It's an Ola set. Okay. That'll definitely be a car I'll be looking forward to coming out. And then this one right here. Whew, this one looks nice. One of the nicest looking cars in my opinion. It's called the Critter. It looks like... A, I'm not sure what kind of cars it is. Let me know in the comments. I'm pretty bad when it comes to some, with some of my cars. I'm good with some of my cars. I'm not. Uh, most of the time, I'm pretty bad with my car's name. So. This car was in the trailer. This kind of looks like the rust in a little bit. With the way the roof is. And the lights kind of look like the rocket voltage lights in the back. It's called the Locus. I really like that. I'm buying that for sure. I'm like, I'm buying every single car though, regardless when it comes out. Showcasing them, uh, doing a customization guide, stuff like that. This is called the Nebula. Uh, I don't know what to think about that. It's, looks like it's not really a car you get too happy about. Now this one, bro. This is one we see in the trailer too. It's called the Neo. Hopefully we get this like next week, bro. I want this out of any car besides the Nero because it looks so freaking nice. And I can't wait to get that. It's called the Neo. That's a cool name for that car, too. It looks like some that would be called a Neo. This one's called the Novak. It's like some kind of like SUV, maybe like a Mercedes, if I'm not mistaken, in real life. I'm not 100% for sure. And then this one is called the Paragon 2. It's got armor plating on it. Now, I believe uh, we already get... No, we got this in game already. I believe you unlocked this, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, the armor plating. And then you get the Pioite. Pi Pioite. Pioite. <laughs> Peyote 2. Peyote. <laughs> Peyote 2. I mean, just guys think about this. Now, this right here, bro, this looks crazy. Now, I believe it's supposed to have two wheels on it, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, that seat don't look too comfortable, but uh, it looks pretty fast, and I'm going to buy it for sure. It's going to be uh, pretty interesting. There's always some kind of vehicle like this, like a rocket, Voltic, or some kind of rocket vehicle. All right, we already got that one today. We got that today, the Thrax, the Xeon 3. Do we get that today? I don't think we did. It looks like an older, like, 90s type theme car. This one, too. Ooh, this looks nice. This almost looks like the same end as the uh, the Zaruso. It almost looks like the same back end as the, um, the Bugatti. The Bugatti Devo that we have in game. All right, now I wanted to show you guys some HD images provided by Foxy Snaps. Uh, right up here, he just posted them. All right, so we got these right here. And these are the gonna, these are in order too. These these are all in order. So the next one we're going to be getting is a Neo. Yes, so it's going to be one eight one point eight million. And then we'll probably get it uh, this coming up week. 
And then we got the Progen or Ermus, Ermus, however you say it, 2.7 million. Now, these cars are expensive, man. I'm telling you. Um, that looks real nice. I'm copping that. Dude, these are all cops. Uh, this 10 out of 10 cop, 10 out of 10 cop. Illicit Locust, 10 out of 10 cop. Uh, Benefactor Krieger, uh, $2.8 million automatic cop. Illicit Jaguar, I uh, gotta get that. Or Juggler. <laughs> um, the Pegasi Zeruso, uh, $1.9 million must cop. Western, I'm getting this. <laughs> uh, it's like basically a million dollars. And this right here is like 600000 Lampetti Novak. And then moving on to Southern San Andreas. These are these cars. The Bravo. Uh, the Nebula Turbo. The Gauntlet Hellfire. Uh, or whatever you call it. It looks pretty dope. Oh, I definitely want to get that. As a classic type of car. The uh, Xeon Classic. The Helion. The Destiny. 450000 And then the Vapid Peyote. Peyote. Oh, I say Peyote. What's wrong with me? Grasser. But like, I'm running off no sleep right now, so... I got an excuse. <laughs> oh yeah, I wanted to show you guys. I just I took a I took a picture recently. Let me actually show you guys. It's actually the price is how much everything is going to be. I'm pretty sure that he retweeted it. If I'm not mistaken, <clears throat> I'm trying to do this all in one video, so I don't got to really edit it. Cause I'm trying to get to sleep because I've not been to bed yet. So I'm trying to get this out quick. <clears throat> so apologies about that. But um, so this total cost of everything casino DLC is sixty three million dollars. Assuming you can buy everything, casino plus styles. Eight million dollars, meaning the you know the um, the what should we call it? Like all the 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 resort stuff, clothing all together fourteen million, decorations seven million, tattoos over one point five million. That's crazy. Vehicles twenty eight million all together. Vehicle mods three million. So I'm assuming that everyone's gonna buy all the clothes for fourteen million dollars. I didn't b uh, barely spend any money on clothes, decorations. I'm sure people are not gonna spend all that much on decorations, tattoos. So let's just say it round up to like, I don't know, 50 million, like, if everyone's buying like all the cars, the upgrades, and the casino stuff, but yeah, man, um, let me know what car you're most looking forward to, if I had to say, it would most definitely be the, the Neo, let me get back up to it, probably, most likely the Neo right here, and also this one right here, dude, all these, the Neo definitely, the Empress, the Krieger, and the Zeruso for sure, I'm curious to see how this rocket bike is going to be. It's probably not going to be done too crazy. And also the Hellcat, I believe, or Hellfire, whatever it's called. It looks pretty dope. But that's going to wrap it up, guys. I just wanted to give you guys a video of all the leaked content, upcoming content, in order to, provided by Foxy Snaps. Like I said, go ahead and give him a follow. And, uh, yeah, it's going to wrap it up. Be sure to like and subscribe, guys, to the channel. I know I did a stream, dude. I had over 100 people watching. It was insane. The stream was so much fun. The casino. Dude, a lot of people are complaining, saying, like, oh, the DLC is not like this or not like that. But, yo, it's about the lux luxury, man. The the height, like, the, the like just the way rocks are updated, man. It looks so crazy. We never had anything like the, like the luxurious, like, uh, resort, like, you know, like, casino. It's so dope, bro. bro. Like, and we got all these nice vehicles. And the only thing I wish, the only complaint I have is the garage. The garage I wish was something like import-export with uh, the, the CEO office's garage. You know, to where it's like we can like make it like decked out with lighting and stuff. Because it's kind of hard to see the cars in there because of the lighting. Anyways, like I said, let's go wrap it up. I'm going to start up a new series here soon. um, Or do something to where I can like get the unreleased cars. uh, Somehow get it working on my GTA 5. Uh, on, the, on my PC for some reason it's not working. But um, if I can figure it out, I'll definitely do a live stream featuring all the unreleased vehicles. Maybe later today or something like that. But uh, yeah, that's going to wrap it up. Hope you guys enjoyed. Have a good one. This is Drama. And I'm out. Peace.